Unraveling the Mystery, Understanding, Harboring Doubts. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating phrase in the English language, harboring doubts. This expression is commonly used, but what does it really mean? And how can you use it effectively in your conversations? Let's explore this together. Harboring doubts is a phrase that combines two words, harboring and doubts. To understand the phrase fully, we need to look at each word separately. Harboring. This word originates from the idea of a ship finding shelter in a harbor. In a metaphorical sense, it means to hold on to something, usually a thought or feeling, in your mind. Doubts. These are uncertainties or a lack of conviction about something. Doubts are feelings of being unsure or skeptical about the truth or reliability of something. When combined, harboring doubts means to hold on to uncertainties or skepticism about something or someone. It implies a state of mind where a person is not fully convinced or has reservations. Understanding how to use harboring doubts in a sentence is crucial. This phrase is typically used in more formal or serious contexts and can be applied to various situations. Personal relationships. After seeing the secretive messages on his phone, she was harboring doubts about his loyalty. Professional settings. The investors started harboring doubts about the sustainability of the startup. General belief. He is harboring doubts about the effectiveness of the new policy. Notice how the phrase is used to describe a continuing state of skepticism or uncertainty rather than a fleeting moment of doubt. When using harboring doubts, avoid these common mistakes. 1. Don't confuse with momentary doubt. This phrase implies a persistent state, not a temporary one. Saying, I'm harboring doubts about what to eat for lunch is incorrect. 2. Context appropriateness. Since it's a somewhat formal expression, use it in the right context. It might sound out of place in casual, everyday conversations. Harboring doubts is a powerful expression that can add depth to your English conversations, especially in formal or serious contexts. It's about holding on to uncertainties and being skeptical. I hope this explanation clears up any doubts you might have been harboring about this phrase. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.